Hi, my name is Russell Visser from Northwest Physiotherapy Group. When people come to see us for treatment, it's because they're in pain, but they often can't understand how a trivial action like you know, reaching for a towel in the bathroom or bending down to pick up something from the floor can cause this episode, this extreme pain they have. Now that's because they have a buildup of strain in their body. Now Graham, my colleague, will talk about this in greater depth. Thanks Russell. So what is a cum cumulative strain? A cumulative strain is strain that builds up in our body over time. When I'm referring to strain, I mean muscle tension, joint stiffness, nerve tension, altered movement patterns, things that build up over time and that we can test for in the clinic. Now why does this happen? Well, basically it happens because not all of our movements in life are done with good posture or good control. So we might bend to pick up our child. We might be in the garden in a poor posture. We might be sitting in a poor posture. We might even be doing exercises in the gym without good technique. All these things cause some strain to develop in our body over time. Now I'd like to show you this, how this develops on this graph. So this graph here explains the cumulative strain and how it develops over time. On this axis here we've got the amount of strain in our body and on this axis we've got time. Here you can see the strain building up slowly over time and this occurs generally from bad posture or bad movement patterns. If the, the strain builds up above this line here, this threshold line, your brain perceives as a problem and will send you a warning sign. The warning sign or signal is generally pain or symptoms and we can see that in this part of the graph here. Our job then is to find what structure is most at fault, the cause of your symptoms, and treat that. And once we do treat that, the level of strain drops significantly. As the strain drops in your body, your, uh, and drops below this symptom threshold, your pain and symptoms gradually subside. When you're at this stage, we can then teach you how to manage this long term to prevent it. That is to pre prevent the strain from building up over time, and also we can teach you some tests to gauge whether this strain is building up over time that you could use at home. Now Russell will summarise inf information and, and also explain why this is so important to know. Thanks Graham uh, for explaining that accumulative strain model. Now to sum up, uh, we want you to understand that when you come to see us, when we treat your strains that are causing the pain, we want you to understand what are the unique circumstances you have? What are the areas that are under load with you? And strategies how to manage that, but also to self-test. So you can detect if that strain is building up again. So you can either modify what you're doing, or you can come and see us before the strain builds up and becomes another episode of pain or injury. And that way, you can stay as pain-free as possible.